most incredible picture is from Chopper 7 over the rescue of a worker who was trapped in a trench. Let's get right to 7 Action News reporter Kimberly Russell live on Detroit's northwest side. And I understand the whole community came together to help this man out. They sure did. Neighbors say that firefighters arrived on the scene, then ran door to door, asking neighbors for shovels, buckets, brooms, anything that they could spare that the firefighters could use to free this man who was trapped in a trench. And neighbors responded. As I arrived, they were bringing every single shovel or broom they could find to firefighters. Firefighters say when they arrived on the scene, there were two men trapped in this collapsed trench in a backyard at Cruz and Puritan. But they quickly freed one of the men. It took about two hours, though, to free the second man. They had to bring oxygen to him because the pressure of the dirt on his chest was making it hard for him to breathe. But I want you to see this video. They rescued him about two hours later, pulled him from that dirt. Now, here's what we know about this man who was rescued. We're told that he appears to be in his 30s. He didn't speak much English. We're told that these men were workers and that they were working on either a water line or a sewer line. Officials really aren't sure at this time. They believe that the person who owns the home hired these people to do the work. Whether they are licensed contractors, we do not know. Whether they should have been in there legitimately, we do not know. It could be under investigation. But the very good news that we have right now is that firefighters quickly responded. They were able to free this man due to the help of neighbors bringing tools, turning garden tools into life-saving tools, and also to heavy machinery that was brought in as it went on. This is a happy ending. We'll bring you more information as it becomes available on this man's condition. But right now, it looks like he is going to be just fine. Live in Detroit, Russell, 7 Action News.